here on the Please Me For On YouTube channel. Month of Freedom. Buenos dias. Buenos dias. El Camino. Here we are. Last day of Midwest Drags. And we are in Norwalk. Oof. The bugs are for real. Oh, no. That's terrible. So we are uh, heading over to the track for like 10 minutes from Summit Motorsports Park, where we ran the first day. And we'll head back there now. Got to grab some ice. We're going to top off our fuel tank for extra weight. And we'll be good to go. I like to whisper softly to... Mullet in the morning when I fire it up. <sighs> to this guy ISF images just brought us these freaking pictures it's so nice yeah, it's amazing. Awesome. so yesterday when we pulled out of the track I ran something over our uh, race fuel pump pulley slid off because we left the set screw or the set screw vibrated loose so we ran over our motion pulley didn't break it's high oh, quality man. parts <laughs> Uh, but we lost the keyway, so Kevin's making a keyway out of our Allen wrench. Yeah, you sacrificed an Allen wrench. All right, it's all good. All right, tires are set. We're fueled up. We got a fuel pump belt on. Doing a little tuning change. Yeah, uh, turn it up. Play with the rear shocks. Yeah, I put something. The track here should be significantly better, better, stickier. So I put something that's not as quite as aggressive as what we had here. Day one. day one, yeah. but it's more aggressive than the two passes yesterday. So. Okay, cool. So we'll get something started. Yeah, just get some good if data, we, hopefully get a good slip. Yeah, if we get two seven-second slips, we secure a win. Okay. So unless the guy can crack off like a five-something, which I don't think is possible. That's pretty fast. <laughs> so, no, I think I think if we get two seven-second slips, we're good. Okay. Let's make it happen. Let's go. All right, here we go. We're actually racing the same blue Nova we did on day one at the same track, so it's gonna look like the same shot.
machinery. It's <laughs> the separation you're looking for here. All right, watch the rim, the top of the rim to the fender. Boom, digging the tire in. Oh, dang. Pointing all, it's, it's lifting the whole car, which like, allows us to apply more power <laughs> and accelerate harder. That's pretty cool. Science. So guys, Tom Bailey has freaking air horns on his ice cream truck and he always sneaks up on me and blasts his air horns. So now is my opportunity to sneak up on him. Finally my day to get, you didn't flinch dude. You've been chasing me. that all the time? Yeah, you've been chasing me with the damn ice cream truck. Thought I had a chance. So we limited the front travel. We fixed the trans leak. We added trans fluid, it was a little low. And then spiced up the boost. Spiced up the boost. And added some preload to the anti-roll bar in the back so that it didn't drive. It kind of drove right on the last pass. So we're gonna try and get it straight. Ready? Yep.
your first drag and drive event. I don't know how fast that was, but that was, that was probably a high seven. I don't think that was as fast as our uh, 64 earlier, but at least it went down and Oh man, I can't believe it just won his first freaking event out. Actually, I can believe it. Kevin, you're a freaking beast, dude. This car is incredible. Woo! <laughs> yes! That's Kevin's first win at one of these, too. Thank you. 50s and 40s, but we got some stuff to change, I think. Yeah. We have some data to, look, data to look at. Some different shocks to put on it. We're going to throw a different set of shocks on it to uh, allow it to travel right. Like, it's traveling right for a slow, high, high, seven, high, seven, high seven, seven second car, but it ain't traveling right for a low seven second car or a six second car. So, yep. we talked to the AFCO guy. We're going to get revalving done this week so that before we go to Rocky Mountain Race Week, she's dialed. Freaking A. Woo. Knocking down a seven second average. I think we averaged around like seven, six, high 760 or low 770. Yeah. For our first time out. And we're like third or fourth overall in the event, which yeah. is mind boggling, or maybe fifth. Yeah. Overall, on all the cars, Mullet on his first time out is freaking top five. Sweet. Insane, dude. All right, well, let's uh, let's start packing up and Pack we'll her up. close her out. That's it, Kev. A 764 and a 781. Nice job. All right, so since we turned in a faster than 10.5 slip at every track, two of them each, we get to enter for a chance to win a Chevy 2. And there's not that many in there. Modified power adder. Uh-oh. Latest McFarland. Woohoo! Dang! We did it. That's a nice trophy. That's pretty cool. That's a nice Woohoo! Let's go, Kev. It's first time out, dude. Yeah. Hell yeah. We were just breaking it in. Yeah. Just breaking it in. Breaking really? Yeah. Well, we got to go show it tomorrow. Oh, look. You can see through it. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. 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 No way. I don't know. I don't know, but I'm excited for the guy. <laughs> we got a match. Woo! <laughs> that is so cool. All right, Kev, you ready? Yes, sir. Let's take our trophy and run. Well, brother, I'd call that a big success. Big success. Great the weekend. brand new car. Great week. Yeah. Oh, dude. Freaking fantastic. Midwest Drags, first one we went to, we won in a brand new car. Brand, brand new, car. new car. All right, guys, thank you so much for following us around on Midwest Drag Week. We have Rocky Mountain Race Week in one week from today. One week. So that's kind of part of the reason why we called it early. Could we have ran faster? Yes. But we're going to get the shocks revalved and some other things, and we're going to hit Rocky Mountain Race Week hard. So the car's going to Kevin's for a little bit to get a couple things fixed. And then back on the trailer and out to Colorado. So we're also sending Ruby and my brother's Mustang to Colorado. But uh, oh man, what a week. I'm so pumped. Shout out to Kevin, dude. Amazing work, my Ooh. friend. Thank you. Woohoo. All right, running off there with the trophy. Thanks for watching the for today. We'll freaking see you later. Oh yeah, I forgot I got Drift Night, which by the time you're seeing this video, Drift Night is tonight at the Freedom Factory. Come on out. <laughs>